everyone. This is uh, Jay Dobbins of the Marvel DC Multiverse. We are live at Planet Comic Con 2021, and I have a very special guest with me here today. Please uh, tell everyone uh, your name and where you're from. My name is Chris Roop. I own Rupp's Comics out of Fremont, Ohio. Uh, Rupp'sWorld.com. We service all sorts of comic stuff from a million comics in our warehouse of just our good stock to tons of overstock that we have. Uh, celebrating 30 years this year and just having fun here at Planet Comic Con in Kansas City. This is our second time here and we love it. We're glad to be back and back on the con circuit. All right. So, uh, can you tell everyone which, uh, which day was your busiest day? Like, was it today, yesterday, or was it Friday? I would say Friday and Saturday were really busy. Today, it's still growing. I mean, we're still just only a couple hours into the day. So, everything's going really great, though. It's been a great show. Uh, the team here at Planet Comic Con is amazing. The fans are amazing. Uh, we just have a blast coming here. And, all right. So, um, out of all the comics that you sold, like, mm -hmm. uh, have you read any of them? I've read. I still. That's the one great thing. Thirty years into this, I don't read as many comics as I used to every day. Uh, but I still love reading comics. Uh, it's like it's one of those things. You get to do what you love and enjoy, and it's the experience of talking with fans and your friends about the storylines and everything's going on, what you like, what they like, and what I don't like, and that, but teach your own. And so yeah, I, I still, I just finished the other day, I just finished reading Gideon Falls. I like read the first trade and then like, I've, I've been to the next, what, five in three days. Okay. And that, loved it, Jeff Lemire did an amazing uh, job of that series. Loop, um, recently, I mean, it, it's like, there's just so many okay, comics that are still catching up on. But, you know, having a six-year-old, that's a little bit of stuff. All right, so, I mean, hopefully, you know, it wasn't a stupid question. Um, you know, the reason why I asked, because there was one comic book owner, or, well, there was someone who worked at a comic book store mm -hmm. down in uh, Metcalf in Oakland Park, and he hadn't read a single one. That's, I don't under, I do run into retailers who, who don't read comics, or the only comics they read were, you know, the ones they grew up on, the stuff from the 60s and the 70s. It's, I, I don't, I personally don't understand that, that if you cannot talk the comics to your customers, you can't help them. And that, and that's ninety. There's plenty of comics I don't like, and that. And if I if I start reading and I don't like it, I just say it's not my cup of tea, and that. But I also encourage them to try it out based on what I've heard. And then there's times when there's books that will guarantee. You come in the store, and it's like I say I have so much faith in this book that if you like, like uh, Birthright from uh, Joshua Williamson, if you like Jumanji and Conan, Conan mixed together. You're gonna love Bertha and that. And then I say, take the first trade. If you don't like it, bring it back and switch it out for something else. All right, uh, I'm gonna have to check out that comic book whenever I have yeah, a chance. It is great. Birthright, there's so many great books, both at Marvel, DC, but then Image and a lot of these other independent companies. Uh, Aspen Comics, Boom Studios, uh, IDW, all of them are producing such amazing content. And then you have people like Jeff Lemire, and James Tynan, who are spread out over so many different companies. It's like, so it gives you a chance to try other things from other companies, but still with some of these amazing creators. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you. Everybody have a great night. Ciao. All right, well, that concludes this uh, interview. Feel free to visit us, like us on Facebook. We're available on iTunes, Google Play Music App, Spotify, and of course, YouTube.